The Basilica of the Holy Sepulchre in the heart of the old city of Jerusalem receives thousands of pilgrims from all over the world. Inside are Calvary, the site of Jesus' crucifixion and death, and the tomb where Jesus' body was laid and where he rose again. On this Monday, in front of the edicule of the Holy Sepulchre, the community of the custody of the Holy Land in Jerusalem gathered for the solemnity of the dedication of the Basilica on the 15th of July 1149. The feast dates back to the Crusader era. Every year, the celebration provides a remembrance of the many vicissitudes that the Basilica has gone through up to the present day. It bears witness to the death and resurrection of Jesus, preserving the place where these historical events took place. For Brother Francesco Patton, Custos of the Holy Land, this place reminds us and bears witness to the historical reality of the death of Jesus. All three readings tell us about it. However, the readings remind us that this empty tomb is also the concrete and physical place of the resurrection of Jesus Christ. The sepulchre conveys to us precisely the historical experience that Jesus had as the incarnate Son of God. He died like us and thus shared our whole life, including the experience of suffering and dying. And yet this place also conveys to us the other side of the coin, namely the resurrection. The reality of the resurrection of Jesus. Therefore, it is a fundamental place for us because our faith is in fact based on the passion, death and resurrection of the Lord Jesus. If this were a myth, if this were an invention or the fruit, as some exegetes said, of a hallucination of the women who came to the tomb, our faith would be founded on something very fragile. Instead, this physical place continues, like all the holy places in the Holy Land, to bear witness to the historicity of the salvation that God gives us, and also to the fact that our faith as Christians is a faith that is based on a historical fact, on the mystery of the Incarnation. The Basilica of the Holy Sepulchre is a place of pilgrimage and awaits pilgrims. We hope the pilgrims can return soon. Unfortunately, we have not seen any pilgrims for nine months, but we hope that this place, which is also the sign of reconciliation between God and mankind, and between mankind itself, may somehow obtain the gift of peace. May those who pray in this place obtain the gift of peace, and with the gift of peace may the pilgrims also return. At the moment, there are also excavation works to further improve the reception of pilgrims. Thanks to these excavations, we discovered the earlier basilicas. This is the Crusader Basilica, the Byzantine Basilica. In all the history of this place, today we celebrate the dedication of the Basilica of the Holy Sepulchre. This is the Crusader Basilica, but we also commemorate the dedication of the Byzantine Basilica in September. These two churches are celebrated today, and we can also see them thanks to these excavations. We truly hope that, as is the case, always many Christians from around the world, but also many children of Abraham, Jews, Muslims, come to this place. And it is always beautiful to contemplate through the diversity of the pilgrims who are here that Christ is the victor over death to save all the children of Adam, all humanity. And so for us to celebrate here really means reviving our faith, giving solid foundation to our hope and in turn being invested with this role of witness, just like the women, like Mary Magdalene, like the Apostles.